Good morning, Baytown. I'm Mayor Brandon Capitillo. I'm here at City Hall. I'm here with our City Manager, Jason Reynolds, and we wanted to go and speak to you uh, a little bit what to expect this week. Uh, certainly last week about this time, it started off obviously stormy with Hurricane Barrel. We were all experiencing that event. The end of the week uh, ended a lot better. More people were restored with power. We were able to go and distribute about a thousand hot meals to the community uh, here at the community center. And then this weekend, a big push from Center Point to go and restore more power to many homes in Baytown. And so looking at that, we are very aware of uh, where the power outages are. We communicate that constantly with Center Point uh, to let them know any neighborhoods that have not been addressed, uh, any particular streets that we've been told uh, they have issues. They are aware of, of all the downed trees that may have wires. So I will uh, reiterate, do not mess with these trees. We do not know if there's live wires there or not. Uh, the City of Baytown employees and our staff, we cannot touch those, those, um, those trees that have wires in it. I would, we, we strongly suggest you do not do the same, but Centerpoint is aware of those, uh, those downed trees. Uh, so about 10% of Baytown is still without power, I think, as of today. Uh, but we are, we are told that they will continue to push uh, very strongly throughout uh, Monday, Tuesday, the rest of the week to go and restore as many people as we can to get them back on to the, you know, to the power grid uh, as safely as possible and quickly as possible. So what you can expect this week is a lot of debris pickup. And so uh, I know a lot of you, we drove the city yesterday. There's a lot of folks and you're doing great. It looked really good. A lot of brush, right? So make sure you do separate your brush pile. Uh, from uh, any, kind of, any type of building materials, and then a separate, if you have it, where we call them white goods, uh, appliances, anything like that, separate that separately. Uh, so you will probably either see our city crews or possibly a contractor from the city. And so that's what we really want you to know to expect this week is uh, the city's response uh, to debris pickup. And so uh, again, uh, trash pickup is on its regular schedule. And then also, um, we don't want to let you know that you will continue to see mosquito spraying in Baytown. Uh, you know, after any big rain event, mosquitoes go and they're empowered and you'll see them and we want to make sure that we can go and spray them as weather allows us to do. Uh, I'm here also, if you look real quick, here at the permits uh, at City Hall on Market Street. So we have waived the permit fees for any storm related damages, either if it's uh, some uh, repairs you have to do to your electrical system, whatever the case may be, those fees are waived. And so we want you to just come out here, you'll have a, a, a licensed uh, electrician, contractor, whatever the case may be, to go and take care of whatever repairs appropriate for your, uh, your particular home. Uh, so the library is open, it's regular hours. Uh, cooling center and shelter is at San Jacinto Christian Church, uh, which is on Alamo Street. Uh, so they will be able to go and, and provide you uh, some, a nice, good, cool environment if that's uh, still so needed. Uh, and as always, we always want you to be safe and take care of each other. There's a lot of things that will still happen throughout this week as we recover uh, from the hurricane. And so with that, take care and God bless.